Hola, mi amigos and fans. It's time for you to see my fantasy act. Okay, extremely late jokes aside, today we're going down Route 5. And we've been ambushed by Bianca immediately. And she gives us the HMO2. Fly! Okay, it looks like Bianca's actually started to... Actually, oh, she always gives us good stuff, so whatever. Yeah, we did see one, didn't we? In uh, Lost Thorn Forest. Which reminds me, we should go back and check that one day. Okay, there's a kid grotto right behind her and she doesn't notice. Let me move! Let me move! Let me move! No, oh, but I'm being dragged. And it's a... It's a okay, that's just weak. weak. It's a Mencino. Hate Mencino. <coughs> No, come back here, I hate you, so I'm just gonna take it on because I'm gonna get experience out of it. And Sinnoh is like really bad Pokemon for the record. Um, oh yeah, it is bad. Actually, yeah, it does get, actually no, it's not bad, it's just okay. It's like sadly just adequate. No, no, not sing, not sing. Why sing? I'm about to get hit in the face. Twice. Thrice. Four times. Can't it just end? <laughs> and so auto levels up despite getting hit in the face a lot. And at level 28, he gets to pick up the move Revenge. It's a 60 base power of fighting type move that doubles in power every time if you got hit with a move in the turn b before you use Revenge. In the same turn, though. He's like, I'm taking Revenge for the time you hit me. Pwn! So, me yeah, and now I'm about to use a few TMs that I picked up. Fly is naturally going to phaser because he flies around like a boss. And I'm, okay, I'm replacing Lear because Lear is a terrible move. And I'm also pick using this uh, TM Volt Switch to replace a Thundershock with a Magna. Because Volt Switch is like way more powerful. That's all, yes. You can chat with the person here, and then she'll I'll sell you berries for 200. How are these berries? I don't think they do anything, do they? Let's see, what do those berries do? Oh, okay, so they do something. They increase friendliness, lower stats. Screw that. So, um, Phaser's taking the lead now, mainly because I know exactly what the next few trains are going to carry. And I'm being ambushed by the Baker. Help! Psychotic Baker! Need immediate evac! <coughs> okay, maybe, maybe after I defeat her, she'll give me... They'll say, okay, if I defeat you, give me a cupcake or brownie or whatever you're baking. And so it's a sunker and terrible. Air cutter. Cut that thing down. So naturally, Phaser's just going on an OP streak. Where he's just too OP to keep. Actually, yeah, he's only OP against bug types and grass types because they're terrible. Phaser dodges, brings down the fly. So we defeated him, Baker Jen. Oh, Cupcake, seriously? So now we're gonna just bow the dancer. We'll see how he dances.
gets this. The heat. And he's got some dance moves and he's got Scraggy, which. Okay, yeah, Phaser's about to go even harder on him, this guy. Go up. Yes. Come down. Strag Scraggy just fainted on the spot. Did you see how powerful that was? Okay, I'm taking you on. Okay, yeah, this guy's a jerk. He's like, oh, just because you don't do musicals because they're gay, I won't bow you because I like gay stuff. I hate musicals for the record, they're just silly. Okay, Joy. It's a bunch of cheerleaders. Help me, moi! So, Ava and Aya sent out their Mincino twins, which makes me hate them even more. So, yeah, now I'm just gonna bring down the meteors. So I'm revenging one Mincino, except they're both shooting swift, which I hate. So, um, yeah, Otto's in a bad condition. Phaser's not a lot better. This is still really terrible. But prepare! The Mincino's about to die! Boom. And Phaser's gotten to level 26. Phaser avoided the attack because he's up so high. So we defeat the ridiculous cheer girls. Defeated! So I'm switching a Magnum back to the lead. Oh wait, yeah, you know that trailer back there? Inside there's a person who you can sell tiny mushrooms to. And big mushrooms. Ah! Now I've been called! I don't want to talk right now. Yes. So yeah, that was weird. Anyway, so apparently if you fill out the surveys in Castelia City's, um, what's its face? Place and uh, that um, shop um, password by Analytics HQ. If you go, you get statistician, take the surveys, then and you'll start talking about the stuff you filled in there. So you just talk to the person here, and you can sell your tiny mushrooms. I don't know. Maybe you can sell berries. Explain to selling mushrooms because they're cheap and they don't mean anything. I'm not sure if people can eat berries. And now I'm about to see how you do it. Where are your pals? R R. Okay, no pals. It's group pal. Max repel? Okay, no, no, no repels. But you guys just have to do this the old fashioned way. Run. A lot. Skirt the edges. Help! He wants to collide! It's something. I don't know. So, artist Horton said that was Sigilith. And now you understand why he said Magnum to the front. Because he can't take the sick. Because Sigilith can't take that now. So naturally I'm just coming out with the sonic boom off the bat. Really, they want to make sure Volt Switch can hurt it, can fish him. Okay, no, no, no! Whirlwind! Whirlwind! Bro, that's not even cool. And Otto is in no condition to take on a Sigilith. Because of how badly he's been beaten around. Ah, but he pulls through somehow or the other. Except, yeah, no condition whatsoever. Yes, yes, you did. Ah, 
ambush! Help me! It's a rubbish! It's a bag of rubbish giving life that's just scarier! I'm being set up on! It's getting worse! Oh god, no, no drama's not suiting me. You know, I can kill Trubbish right now with a full switch, but no. Nah. Anyway, so Otto needs to be healed frantically. I'll toss him a lemonade, see how he gets stuff. And I'm now switching Esper to take a lead here. Oh, Sarah Repel! I thought you'd bother to come earlier. So now I'm just challenging another Pokemon Ranger. He's talking about electrification. Please don't electrocute me, I don't want to get the electrocuted, I hate that process. Okay, I have future sighting to start off, simply because I know I can want to tell, but I deal with, um, what's his face? Ah, stun spore, stun spore, stun spore, no, no, no! No paralysis! Okay, at least I can take a little revenge of that format. No, I just wanted to play around with Future Sight. Actually, I did not expect getting paralyzed like that. And so Roselia comes in. It's like Badio's evolved form, which is even more dangerous if you ask me. No! No! I'm being set up on even harder. And I'm probably not going to be able to take it out because Roselia does have a decent amount of special defense. Oh, not enough. And Esper goes up a level. Double bow, double bow, it just sucks. Trubbish and Gathita. And Spernardo. So, yeah, I'm running. So, um, okay, yeah, Phaser's getting us switched out for a magnet. And. My propulsion, picked it up right in the middle of the road. And now on to the main thing. Sorry. And today, rotation back. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forget my name, Charles. Oh, is it full throttle? Well, let's do this, let's do this. So now we're taking on the Heartbreaker, who breaks people's hearts because he's got nothing better to do in life. And, and his own heart was broken because the girl of his dreams rejected him. Yeah, I don't know, understand people. I'm never going to. Okay, so battle, rotate, and Magnum Volt Switch. Do the switch. Well, the wide guard is absolutely useless. What are you doing? And so Magnum pulls out after getting a pretty quick kill. If you ask me. And now Dracon's gonna start getting kills with Rock Slide. <laughs> 